Get your damn hands off them. Okay, just put the gun down. There's not a problem here. Harassing a woman in a dark alley is definitely a problem for the woman. Yeah. She's stalking me. Mm -hmm. I totally leave me alone and I don't even know how many ways, but obviously nothing is getting through. Keep walking. Yeah. What'd you have to go and do that for? Oh, simple thank you would be fine. I was about to get information out of... About what? Never mind. Thank you for your help, even though I didn't need it. You're coming with me. Staff's gone. We're the only ones here. Should I be flattered? You want to be alone with me? Okay. I just wanted to make sure that no one could overhear us. Please sit. <clears throat> okay. So I think that I've proven you can trust me, yes? Yes. I need to know if my sister's safe and if you've spoken to your brother. I've only spoken to John one time. He called me. I was with my father, so I couldn't really talk to him, but he said he was, said he was okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm concerned about your brother as well, but is Lulu okay? Well, um, yeah. I mean, look, John's not ever going to let anything happen to Lulu. You know, he, um, I hate to say this, but he really cares about her. I think he's in love with her, so... Yeah, she's safe. That's great. Well, thanks for telling me about the phone call. My brother's not going to let anything happen to your sister. Oh. Well, unfortunately, there are some things that your brother can't protect Lulu from. Warning signs. You know how much the fear was taking its toll on Lulu? <laughs> and you'd think growing up with a father like Luke that she'd be a bit more cynical, but... Like me! <laughs> Lulu, she's, she has a, a kind, loving heart, you know, just like her mother. And for me, I've always had this, this fear hanging over me that I'd, that I'd turn into my father, and now I look at her and it's, I don't know, she's a lot, she's a lot stronger than me. Maybe I'm not giving her enough credit. Well, listen, I mean, worry, <clears throat> when you're an older sibling, a big brother, it just sort of goes with the territory, right? I mean, I tell myself all the time, hey, Johnny's competent, perfectly competent, and he's going to be okay, but I'm scared out of my skin because I'm not there to protect him from those trigger-happy fools, and I, know. I just, I love him so much. If anything ever happened to him... No, I believe me, I, I know. You it's don't just... know. I don't know. No. I don't know. Something inside of me would break, and I would become the monster that everyone thinks that I am. Well, this would it, would it be okay if we you know, passed along information to each other, shared shared information, maybe work together on this? Would that be okay? Nicholas, if you really mean that, then you know, let's do it right away. I mean, let's let's do it now. Uh, okay. Let's do whatever it takes to bring Johnny and Lulu home safe. <laughs>